Hi everyone, uh, my name is Laura Love Toady and this is my first vlog. Vlog? Is that how you, you have, people actually call it vlog when they say they're, v, it's not vlog. Shut up. Okay, take two. Hi everyone, my name is Laura Love Toady. This is my very first uh, vlog. If that's not what it's called, let me know. Uh, so, it's my first one, because I just thought, why don't I do something fun and different for the masses? Because I follow a lot of people, I follow a lot, of, a lot of blogs and a lot of vlogs and a lot of um, lifestyle slash fashion slash, uh, like I follow a lot of mommies. Uh, and I'm always like, wow, their lives are so beautiful. Their lives are beautiful, all their pictures are beautiful, their videos are lovely. They know exactly what they're talking about all the time. Uh, and they seem, seem to be living the perfect life. And I thought, what if I flip it for myself? Because I am far from perfect. Uh, and did it from that point of view. So that's what this is. Basically, you're gonna see me try to do things and fail at things from a normal perspective, which is why behind me you're seeing the um, mess that is most of the time my life. So my shoes back there that I don't wear uh, very, mu very much of, which Today is a purging day, hopefully. Fingers crossed I will be purging. That's what this video is gonna be about, really. My bed is like, the comforter on it is actually good. It's good, everything's clean. I actually made my bed today. Uh, but as you can see, I've made, I've made a, a, a bit of a mess of it. And that's normally what it looks like. Literally, that's what it looks like all the time my extra rack of clothing because not that does not fit in that tiny closet that's real that's real y'all uh, my husband gets like this much space to put his stuff in and then and then he has to do that that pile of clothing that's that's his and this is actually my life uh and you're gonna if you follow me at all or happen to stumble upon this and are still interested, this is what you're gonna see. Uh, it should be fun. So I'm gonna go through what I did with, I think people talk about like what their skincare regimen is, so that's what we're gonna do today. I am on my lips wearing this vanilla, vanilla, you can't see that shit. Oh, also, FYI, this is not gonna be safe for the children. Don't play this at work. I have a bit of a potty mouth. Unapologetic, I got a potty mouth. So the EOS, is that how you say it? I don't even know, EOS. I use their products, they're usually coming in egg. Well, I don't like the egg because I think it takes up too much space in my purse. So the, we got these sticky ones. It's EOS, I think it's vanilla delicious and it lasts for like ever like I haven't really I've had this for like a month and I haven't used very much of it at all it's good go get some I think I got it at uh, Kohl's but they're at Walmart and Target and wherever you wherever you probably like to shop for lip balm they got this uh, let's see what did I do my face I washed it <clears throat> I washed it with ooh I washed it with, let's go take a walk. Uh, oh, in the background is Erica Badu. Badu-ism, because I love her. I love her, oh, it's dark, ah! It, it's, she, I often listen to her when I'm getting ready because um, it's real chill, and she's an awesome singer. Uh, awesome singer, awesome writer, amazing artist, and I listened to that one in particular because that was my introduction to the Erica, uh, and I used to listen to it 
my my beehive friends will know this if you're if you're watching this beehive beehive family uh we would listen to it while we got ready for the show all right on to the real video so what i used on my face today which i am not wearing any makeup which never happens i'm going to tell you the truth like i i, I don't know how this is happening right now and if this actually makes it onto the interwebs, I will be very surprised. But no makeup. Here's what's on my skin. I used Tony Moly. Tony Moly? You can't. That's backwards. That's the wrong way. So Tony Moly Natural Green Moisture Foam Cleanser Shea Butter. I guess that's the flavor, the shea butter. Um, I bought this at Ulta. Uh many moons ago and it came in a package of two so it's lasted forever you don't have to use very much it's super gentle and moisturizing like my skin never feels dry afterwards so that's what i use on my face to wash it i just got this the other day at ulta obviously i'm a fan of ulta so go there rice smooth toner also by tony moly um and FYI, if if you have an Ulta near you and you haven't been in a while and you enjoy the Korean beauty products, um, they are uh, uh, embracing K-beauty and have like a section, like everything was changed around when I went to Ulta the other day. <clears throat> Beautiful. It looks great. Yay, Ulta, Santa Fe, on Cerritos. Uh, but they... Uh, they have a section of like K-beauty stuff. So, you know, the sheet masks and all the serums and essences. Um, but I got this toner, Rice Smooth Toner. It's nice. It's clean. Feels good. I like to, I like to do two things. I like to swipe it with a little bit of a, swipe my face with, with a cotton pad first. And then I like to put the toner in my hands and kind of pat it in. So it's doing like two different things. First it's, I'm cleaning off excess, maybe soap or any makeup that I didn't get or any dirt that I didn't get with the cleanser. I'll, I'll do that first to, just to get the extra gunk. And then pat in the toner. I keep looking at myself. I've never done this before. I'm sorry, but also thanks. Um, <clears throat> You pat it in so that the other benefits, because it cleanses, but it's also supposed to be good for keeping your face clean and keeping your pores clean and smoothing and all of that good stuff. So pat it in. And then I did this spray, which I got on Mimi Box. Anybody shop on Mimi Box? Let me know. Uh, ch they changed it. My Mimi Box is different than it was. I haven't purchased anything from them since their change into this. It's become this other thing. If you do the Mimi box or have done the Mimi box, you'll know what I'm talking about, but it doesn't matter. Anyway, Secret Key Starting Treatment Aura Mist with Galactomyces. Uh, I don't know what those are, but I'll show, uh, hold on. How do I turn the, no, I can't. So this is backwards. I'm sorry. How do I? I don't know what the hell. Anyway, that's what it's called. Anybody who knows what Galactomyces sees, sees, are, let me know. Because I don't know what they are, but the thing is it smells amazing and it feels really great. So I spritz that on, pat it in again. That's like a big deal. Like you got to pat it in. Use the warmth of the skin from your hands to pat in the, the products. I don't know why, I just saw it on somebody else's vlog and I was like, I'm going to do that too. And it works. It really helps to seal in and absorb the stuff that you're spending so much money on. It's good stuff. Um, and then I used, ooh, this is a multifunction formula all-in-one snail repair, repair cream by Mizan. Mizan. I will put the names of all of this stuff where you can read it and actually, if you care, uh, and hopefully if I figure it out, some links to where you can get them. But also I got this from Mimi Box. It's good stuff. It basically has everything all in one. It says all in one. It is all in one. It's serum. It's 
um, essence, it's moisturizer, it's uh, got 92% snail extract, which if you're into the K-Beauty, you know what the snail stuff does. It's good for <clears throat> skin cell turnover, it good, it's good for, um, uh, um, it says right here, skin repair, it um, is an effective moisturizer if you're not into the heavy, heavy um, skin creams. Um, what else is it? It does a lot of stuff. It's good. I don't know what. It helps with like wrinkles. It is like a, it's like one of those miracle, miracle products. This is probably old news, but again, hashtag late as usual. That's me. Um, but yeah, that's that. And then I used, oh, I love this stuff. I don't use it very often because I don't have very much of it left and it's expensive. It's, Do it's Dr. Jart's Water Drop Moisturizer. It's a gel-like consistency. There's no fragrance. It's super gentle and it's super hydrating. Like it feels like um, they made a jelly out of just like the best water. And you put it on your face again, patting it in, pat it in. Um, it's it's love it's lovely um, and super light, but ultra moisturizing. And then for under the eyes today, normally I use like a pretty heavy eye cream because this is it. I this is for real an issue because um, I like to smile and I like to laugh. And I don't like to sleep. <laughs> but this is a Key West Aloe Cucumber Under Eye Gel. And it relieves puffiness. It says 80% aloe. It's delightful. So it's moisturizing, but it's a gel. It's going to, you know, absorb quickly. Um, <clears throat> it's, you know, it's, it's got cucumber in it too, so it's, you know, it's supposed to... Relieve the puffiness. How long is this video so far? Mm, 12 minutes. I got three minutes. No, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do like one more minute. <laughs> Yay! Uh, let's see. My outfit today is, I am wearing uh, this elephant shirt that I got from TJ Maxx uh, three years ago. And it's held up very well very little pilling and the these little jewelry things i wash my clothes on the delicate cycle with a very gentle soap detergent <laughs> whatever um and uh, the little the little bedazzly things have lasted quite a while i like elephants i think they're awesome and i like the shirt because it's soft it's loose I can do anything in it. If I wanted to go take a walk right now, I'd throw my sneakers on and and good to go. I'm wearing leggings by Forever 21. Ooh, for over 21. Um, and that's uh, that's that's gonna be my first vlog, I think. Wow. Let me know if you liked it. Let me know if you didn't like it. Feedback is good. It's appreciated. It's encouraged. This is crooked. <laughs> yeah. uh, but be kind. Again, my first one. Uh, <clears throat> again, I will try and put the... Oh, 14 minutes. So close! I will try and put the, the names of all these products and maybe links <laughs> to where you can get them. Um, and I hope you all have a lovely day. I think, this is what I think. This is my thought for the day. Thought for the day, um, shit ain't perfect, but it can be really fun. So make the most out of it. And uh, I had, I as much of a train wreck as this, this first vlog was, I had, I had a good time. And I actually realized that I, um, I'm not a complete, <laughs> a complete, uh, 
what's the word I'm looking for? Is it idiot? Maybe. Um, no. Not, and I'm not being self-deprecating because whatever. I'm just saying sometimes you feel, sometimes you feel a little bit like, wow, I didn't know that. I must be really, hmm, something's not right. Anyway, that's what I think. But what do I know?